Hello and welcome to day 17 of Infuse and Enthuse. Today the focus is on being mindful um, and I'm one of those people that um, I'm like a little magpie and I see things right, left and centre and I'm so curious that I find it really hard to stay on the straight and narrow in um, every sense of the word. And um, it's ironic, well it's not actually, the synchronicity of what my wearing yellow is um, because it's a colour that actually helps you focus. Now it's not something that I thought of when I put it on but it's um, that's the beauty of life that the synchronicity of things come together and it's through an increased awareness that we actually come to realise this. Now um, I've been doing a lot of research on my book um, that I'm writing, Life's a Load of Balls and it's, um, I've been listening to some um, interviews with um, Christopher um, Vogel, who wrote The Writer's Journey, and um, which is a, a breakdown of um, Joseph Campbell's book, The Hero's Journey, and applying those, um, the, the principles to the writer's journey per se. And it's really got my juices going and I'm going, I've got like three notebooks all over over the um, desk and I'm also keen to get into my writing. Um, but I have to keep taking a deep breath and stay with the interview that I'm listening to and to make some notes. And then I'm putting those notes in the chapter there just to remind me when I get to it so that um, my mind is not full. Now that's the difference between being mindful. It's... Um, single-minded and with a focus on something as opposed to being chaotic and having a mindful and confusion um, and again ironically the beauty of the writer's journey is it takes you through a variety of stages of um, the writing process per se but it also makes the it's a metaphor for the stages throughout life and things so much learning in there and as I say all my juices and my cells are jumping up and down with excitement so um, I would encourage you to the single-minded focus being mindful taking the breath which was the first thing that I was talking about the conscious breathing and when you find yourself distracted just do a few rounds of that and bring yourself back to it. Make a little note on the side in case you think you're um, going to forget about it. Leave it with peace of mind that you haven't, you're not going to lose that information so that you can carry on with the task in hand. So, and again, this is the um, the centerpiece of my book, because life's a load of balls, because it's all over the place and it's about finding our own balance and what helps us going. And for me, being that magpie um, all over the place, it's actually um, t takes me off task and uh, off balance uh, if I don't do the stuff that is actually fulfilling to me. So anyway, enough waffling. Have fun being single-minded and enjoy it. Um, unlike the what I originally thought was that this focus stuff was for um, boring old farts, it really does serve you. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.